with Blow Average Gaming. I'm your host, the Blow Average Gamer. Today with me are Andrew, Jacob, Andrew, uh, Andrew, <laughs> no, Andrew, Andrew, and Michael. Thank Sorry. you for joining us. Um, yeah, today we're going to talk about a lot of stuff. As you can see, we're not in the normal studio. We're actually outside in the world, part of the world, part of your world. So here we are out in the open, um, not or because the studio caught fire or anything like we're that. Outside. We are just here. Yes, we're actually on a ping pong table that we were using world. to play um, beer pong earlier. Actually, we're playing condiment pong because beer is frowned upon in modern Please society. Please make sure you say that word very clearly. <laughs> we're playing condom pong. It was really great. Condom pong, you tried Fantastic. So many people are pregnant. I won. No, I lost. Trojan actually is sponsoring us now because of it. <laughs> Sponsored by Trojan. <laughs> Life gets messy. How do you play? Don't let it be 18 years messy. <laughs> That's one of those things. I saw this thing. It said, um, everyone says that um, seven years bad luck by breaking a mirror is the worst thing that could happen. 18 years bad luck by breaking a condom is actually the worst <laughs> thing that could happen to you. Pretty much. Oh, jeez. There's a June bug. Oh! Yeah, I am deathly afraid of June bugs. <laughs> That's, mm, is that Sour Patch? No. This is actually Caramel Apple. Oh, that's his. Yeah. It smells really good. Um, this is my... Sorry, Patch. Yeah. I have 200 bananas in my car. I want to start by saying that. Let's talk about that. <laughs> Let's talk about that. Let's Stop! Talk. You want to get sued? <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait. Is that... Do they, do they have that, like, uh... Do they have that copywritten? Why is yeah. it going dark? I what, don't know. bananas? Because, um, I didn't bring my charger. That's the one thing that I forgot to bring with all my laptop stuff. And I want to save my energy. So, yeah, but I have 200 bananas in my car. Um, the reason for that is I'm doing a homeless thing for my grandparents. I'm being homeless. <laughs> I wanted to start off well, he's trying on to say a good he, note. His grandparents are homeless. Like, grandparents I want to, are I'm being homeless, and I want to make sure I'm stocked up on food. You're, you're good. Stuff. You're good for like a week once they start to go to bed. Just like all these bananas. Uh, this is bananas. You're gonna be a n a n s. You're gonna be this ripped if you eat them all. This is all the bananas. This shit is bananas. B-A-N-A-N-A-S. We are terrible at synchronizing. I have no Ban- idea how to spell bananas. I, I always put too spell. many N's or too many A's. <laughs> Benghazi. A N A N A N A B. Canada. Canada. I don't know. Bananas. I don't know. O N C C O N D O M S. C A N N A B I S. Did I spell bananas? <laughs> no. M I S S I P. Not even close. But yeah, I have two hundred bananas in my car because my grandparents are doing a homeless thing. So I have. Just a bunch of bananas. Like, I want to say a bunch of bananas, but that's the term you use for when you actually have. We have like, a metric bananas. shit ton of bananas. <laughs> have, he has if a you plethora were to wear these bananas, of bananas. I'm. The, I literally was sitting in Vons. I think it was uh, Vons being that guy from the math equations. Because I was like, okay, I need forty pounds of bananas. Siri, how much would the banana weigh? Banana weighs two point two four ounces. Two point two four pounds. So I was like, I need forty pounds of bananas. Each banana weighs point two four pounds. How many bananas do I need? You, you literally made the math equation from like. I did. School. I did. I was <laughs> like, they're gonna there. keep teaching it. Just just it. Gonna, I, I kicked open my first grade teacher's bag. Like, it door. worked. <laughs> it happened. It happened. <laughs> it finally happened. <laughs> Where am I ever gonna use this? <laughs> Justin needs Somewhere in the 40 world. pounds of bananas. Somewhere in the Each banana weighs. Lab. My life is complete. Point two four <laughs> pounds. How many bananas is that? So it's oh. 200 bananas. It's rough. I think the actual answer was if I need to 40 pounds, it came up to 153. But I was like, I went there and I was bagging up the bananas like individually. Like the I'll just take an, an extra 40, 47 bananas. No, I went in and I was like, do you guys? Hey, I just bagged up like. 50 bananas. Do you have How many boxes? pounds is that? <laughs> How many pounds is that? They're like, I don't know. I told my teacher I was never going to use it. <laughs> there, I was like, I work here now. Like, You're <laughs> wrong. Look what happened. <laughs> I work at Vons. I tried to prepare you for the real world, Justin. <laughs> it's like, this is what happens when you know those questions. You go in and you buy bananas from another guy who had those same questions. Who's <laughs> like, I work at Vons. My life may be a failure, but at least I passed my math class. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, 200 bananas in my car right now. You should and take I, them to downtown and open your trunk. Everybody think you're gay. <laughs> <laughs> what? You get stabbed outside of Circle K. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Andrew, yeah, tell us that story about what happened to your brother recently. It's a sad story, but it's not because everything turned out okay. I mean, yeah. <laughs> well, well I mean, except for the whole Ricky. happening thing. The whole part of it. It was still a hate crime. <laughs> the whole middle okay the whole now. Middle, it's kind of bad. So, my brother, who is... Pretty clearly, a homosexual. Pretty clearly gay. How he's clearly? Gay. He's gay. He's married. Him, he's married to a man. Him yeah. and his pretty husband clearly, are pretty I could just gay. Say, you know, he's married to but a man. 
so he went to go get a slushy from Circle K. Very he's gay. In that, well, he's good. in that part of town, as he let us know. He's <laughs> in that part of town. He's in that part of town. And uh, did he mix them all so it made some, a rainbow? So I don't know the whole story. That's how they knew. I don't know the whole story, but some dude like came up and asked for a lighter, and so he let him use his lighter, and then he like he asked for it back. The dude gets mad at him for asking for his lighter back, which. Um, and like, that's I guess he that's says just lighter like, etiquette. He says something about like calling him something. You <laughs> Excuse fuck, me. Like something Fair you fucking gentleman. you fucking faggot and like tries to stab him and like because uh, Peter was wearing a rainbow brisk bracelet and so a like, rainbow brisk uh, br- br- bracelet and so like the dude that goes to stab Peter like like this area and Peter just puts the sl- the slushy cup in front and the guy just stabs into the slushy cup and like and like stabs into Peter's pinky. And yeah, then, so he got his pinky. And I don't know what else happened. I think the dude, like, grabbed his wallet and, like, took the money out of Peter's wallet, but Peter grabbed it back and then jabbed him in the throat, like, Melissa McCarthy in a Identity Thief. So Which is like, funny, because that's what he referenced. He was like, I, I saw an Identity Thief. So it was straight until he... <laughs> so he just went, like, <coughs> boom, and the guy's just like, what are you going to do with all the cops? And he's like, yes, I am! <laughs> I like that it's like, of all the movies, like, your brother has, like, unseen Kill Bill volumes 1 through 9, <laughs> secret, like, endings, crazy fight movie, like, all, everything you've seen is like, what Melissa should I McCarthy? Do I saw Melissa McCarthy <laughs> viper a guy in the throat, and that seems like the best thing to do. Oops. Did you, you just go? break it? Where'd that was go? piercingly loud. That We're was. sorry for our Did you friend. break your vape, bro? Mine's indestructible. It's I all see, metal. It's the Xbox. <laughs> no, I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> There's ghosts, spooky ghosts, <laughs> spooky ghosts everywhere. Aren't you making a new Ghostbusters? <laughs> we don't we don't talk about new <laughs> Ghostbusters. <laughs> I'm working on, I'm working on finishing up a script Strange. that is the Ghostbusters that everyone wanted, and it actually features myself, Michael, and Andrew. Not my friend Andrew, other Andrew. <laughs> My features. other friend, Andrew. Oh, yeah, and friend. my name is Michael, because I introduced myself as Andrew. Michael no, 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 and Andrew. No. I'm not his friend, Andrew. And I'm it just features Andrew. us three as Ghostbusters, the most bumblingest, like, dumb Ghostbusters you can imagine. We're like, I guess we're Ghostbusters now. <laughs> and that's the movie. I don't that's even the have entire a PhD. Movie. Also, I don't know why, but I've been doing I don't have fing- a f- either. I've been doing finger guns a lot recently. I don't know why. <laughs> you so started, I snap so like, someone told I started me I was vaping cool- and finger gunning recently, so I think I'm becoming a douchebag. I don't know. <laughs> someone told me I was, like, a cool stepdad, so I was like... <laughs> Yeah, I got. That's what I do. What I got bit by a radioactive stepdad, so now I started building now, a porch. Now that you vape, you gotta learn the vape life no. signal. It's this, vape life. Vape life. So, so it's not this. It's not this. It's not it's, this. It's halfway, and you keep it together, and then you make a little circle. Vape For what life. purpose? Like, what is this a symbol to? What is that? It's what? to symbol all the douchebags of vaping. Oh, what is that? One in the pink, one in the stink. Vape life. <laughs> one in. Th- both, if one in the shallow pink, one in the shallow stink, is what it is. I like is. that we're referencing all this, and my dad's right in there. <laughs> one in the vagina, one behind you. That almost landed He's on He's turning his. right now. He's like, uh, hmm. I'm so scared. Are you guys scared of June bugs as well? I don't like them. Well, Andrew, your Are dad, you guys pussies as well, or is it just me? Your dad's in there. He's like, I could use that. I could use that. I can be cool now. Be I get it. No, my dad. my dad's cool already. Elder of so. our church. Yeah. <laughs> you should teach him the church. The Holy Trinity. <laughs> Super finger. Oh, well, Superfinger was uh, Dane Cook. Was that you one. know what's still weird to me? The you got you to do the machine gun. You, you, guys ever, <laughs> you guys ever, like, try to, like, finally get to the, we're now to the age where we have to accept that our parents, like, had to have sex to have us? Yeah, that was, like, 11 <laughs> for me. Like, when I went through sex, I was like, oh, yeah. Cool, oh, that's, cool. so that's I'm here because from. of that, right? I went, I went, to, I went, I went to private school, so it's, like, it's still, like, kind of weird for me. It's kind of new to you. I don't want it near me. Like, kill it, please. I, I'm so scared. I don't know where it went. Oh, I kicked it off. You have, like, huge ones here, and I'm so scared. Oh, God. I live right across the street, and I don't get these. these They're just attracted to <laughs> Andrew. Got him. I get I'm bats, so though. I hate June bugs. I don't know why. I'm just terrified of June bugs. Like since I was, my mom told me once when she was like when I was younger, she's like, "Yeah, I'm scared of June bugs." And I was like, "Oh, I should be scared oh, too." Sh- Make your own opinions, Justin. <laughs> I did. It's the you same. don't need to follow them. <laughs> like we're just seeing a white fog go across the thing each time. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. Just... Andrew, where are you going? I'll be back. Kid, where? I'm getting this. I'll be back. I'll be back. Oh, to Telefona? Yeah. You should be there. Talking. Yeah. So, no, and like, like, for me, I don't know. Dark. Like, I don't know if it was because I went to private school or because like you I talk know. louder. There's a microphone right here in front of you. So you, you're, well, you're trying to talk to them, but you're talking no. like it's a secret to me. <laughs> but like, you know, I went to private school, so like, well, sex ed was kind of a thing we didn't really do very much. And I'm, I know some people say, oh, I did sex ed, but we never really did went over it very much at Fresno Christian. 
So like for me, it was kind of a new concept till I got into like public school, and yeah. then it's just like sex, sex, sex. <laughs> the public school. But like you go through that phase where it's just and like I turned nine and it was. Like, and I turned six and it was sex, sex, sex. Well, like, you go through that phase where you're like a total jerk and you realize like, like ew, my parents having sex. Then like you get to this age, you're like, you know what? My parents, parents had sex. They're normal say? people. Can't they just do what Everyone normal one does? Wait, <laughs> why did you say that? So get it? Ew, they had. Sex. Oh, no, 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 like they much. had sex. Really? Because it's like weird to think about your parents doing that kind of stuff. I don't know, but. Like, I don't, I don't think about it. I don't. I, I accept it, but I don't think about it. I don't, I don't. Now I'm thinking. Oh about God, no! <laughs> what? It's on the keyboard. Well, give me Dude. something. I'll oh, vape, I'll vape it away. Died on your keyboard. That's he a, suddenly got a sideways <laughs> hat. It was crazy. <laughs> <laughs> He wants to join. Oh God, no! I'm he wants to. With this. He says Sigma Nu now. He wants to join a fraternity. Oh God! Oh my God! Oh my God! My life is spiraling out of control. Justin, I've never had so little confidence in you. <laughs> I now think that if there was a gunman, you'd just run away and not save anybody. No, 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 no. He would. He would like attack the gunman. But if, if I got if stabbed it was outside a Circle K, if it was a June bug holding a gun, then he'd freak out. I would freak out if a June bug were holding a gun. Holding why would you, guns? Why would you not? I imagine a spider holding seven guns and hopping around on another with a also, tiny little cowboy. <laughs> like have uh, we gotten to the point like in this country in, uh, where a June bug can now access an AR-15? <laughs> well, what's the movie where the girl has the the machine gun for the leg? Oh, uh, machete. Oh, uh, yeah, machete. No, I thought it was grindhouse. It's grindhouse. It's both machete kills. Yeah. Uh, it's a uh, it's a spider with uh, all the legs. It's <laughs> machine guns. <laughs> I have to walk on two machine guns because all my legs are machine guns. This is really inconvenient. It's for like me that dude from spider. Family. That dude from Family Guy who's all wood. <laughs> <laughs> all right, me patches. was a tree. Patches. 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 Yeah. It, it, his whole his whole body's wood too. Yeah. I was yeah. Like, when we How are you? How are you even alive? I don't know. <laughs> I Give thought it was Seamus. Seamus. And Patchy's, Patchy was from SpongeBob. SpongeBob. The one with, he kept switching his eye patch between every. <laughs> <That's> crazy <laughs> that, that is SpongeBob. Patchy is. That is that's true. Who is yeah. also uh, Squanch? Squanchy. Squancher. <laughs> I'm squanching here. Might have a squanch. <laughs> <laughs> I squanched my family. Oh, oh, no, stop saying that. No, don't say that. Like, I, it means like I love, I hate. I think, oh, like I squanch my family. No, oh, no, 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 no. You're using it wrong. <laughs> no, don't say it. Oh, stop, gross. I'm still pumped for someday for Rick and Morty to come back. Yes. Yeah. They said a year and a half or oh. more. Which is. I think it'll be less. Which is an obscene amount of time yeah, like, for such a great it's show. It's like a year and a half or more. No! <laughs> no! <laughs> like, even Walking Dead was like six months. It's like, alright, that's fine. No, 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 it was like six months, and then like, oh, we're going to push it back to like October. And even then people were like, uh, you know, that sucks, but we'll do it. Or if Rick and like, Morty's like, hey, you love this show. Great show, right? You guys all love this show. Year and a half. You know, X-Files technically did it longer. They went from like mid-2000s to like 2015. That was for so. a movie, right? Well, no, because the new season. Well, you know who did it longer was uh, Saturday Night Live, who like stopped in 1970 and didn't start again until like 2000. They began the show in like 1970. Are they stopped it for like I, I don't know what it is. I, I don't look. Like, you called me on it. I don't know the actual <laughs> years. <laughs> but it's look, a lot of years. Me, well, there was a dark age, there was a dark age, and then Eddie Murphy came in and he like reinvigorated the whole. Like, I'm Eddie Murphy. And it's like oh hey. <laughs> Bananas hit. What? <laughs> you know from Beverly Hills Cop? I'm Gumby. Mother. <laughs> Just my favorite scene. <laughs> Have you seen Jay Farrow's impersonation of like all those people? Uh, no. Oh my god! Is it spot like, on? Yeah, he's like, wee, 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 and it's like Eddie Murphy, and it's like sounds just like Eddie Murphy. <laughs> I know that Jay Farrow in the the, the ones like that he can show. do. Stop uh, it! Uh, <laughs> the ones that he can do, he does great. Which he does a lot of them, but like I know he's just like, oh, you want me to do Eddie Murphy? Fine, I'm Eddie Murphy, and he's like suddenly Eddie Murphy. Uh, just morph. <laughs> I was Eddie Murphy all along. <laughs> no, you can't get rid no, of me. No, he just he just does the, the the man with no face. He thing. did it once, and then he was the nutty professor. <laughs> it's like <gasps> the serum finally wore off after all these years. Oof. Oh, Jay Farrell is nutty professor, like a revamp of nutty professor. I've never good seen or bad. Professor. Have you seen nutty professor? Yeah. Yeah, a revamp with Jay Farrell. Jay Farrell. Or Bobby Moynihan Maybe. on it. Anything besides Bob, SNL. He turns into Bobby Moynihan as the Nutty Professor. <laughs> so I'm he becomes in. white and Jewish. Like the Jeez. <laughs> Did you ever watch by the, in a, was it Mist, not, Mystery Team, I think? Mr. Megorium's Wonder Emporium starring Dustin Hoffman? No, Mystery Team starring Derek Comedy. Oh, yeah? <laughs> Where it's like, did you fuck this bread? <laughs> did you fuck this bread? I like Come on, man. There's a scene where he has to reach into the poop to find a diamond, like the stripper poop. 
There's something watch, sharp inside something soft. You have to watch the movie. <laughs> it's oh, disgusting. Oh, there's something sharp inside of something soft. Or when he has to dress up like a hobo to infiltrate the hobo, like, circle or of trust. They go to a gentleman's club dressed up as gentlemen. <laughs> like, no, that's not what this is. This is a picture of you. This is a library card. And this is just a picture you drew of a shark. <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> He's harum. Top of the morning. Uh, I still like that. And I've been practicing it all day. Fuck. <laughs> <gasps> yeah, it feels good, doesn't it? <laughs> That's such a good show. We need to watch this. Have you seen Derek Comedy? No. Oh, have you seen oh, Derek Comedy? No. What? I mean, so we're just sitting over here. KP. <laughs> we're like, Kid, Kid Parkinson's. Parkinson's. Have you seen Bo Burnham, though? Yeah. <laughs> Andrew I hates Bo Burnham. Burnham. With a bloody patch. Everyone Burnham. here, only Andrew hates Bo Burnham. So Andrew's wrong, based on consensus. <laughs> <laughs> like, based on consensus. So when, and voting, put those Andrew's wrong. Put those I don't know how to work this thing. <laughs> you put, you take this. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Here's a magic trick. So, blow the smoke real quick. Here comes. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, I didn't look cool. <laughs> there was some <laughs> You were supposed to, like, just like. <laughs> I'm scared of you, but I'm sorry, we're outside, there's engineering. wind. And I keep on telling myself, like, there's Skip nothing they're going to do to me. I know for a fact there's nothing they can do to me. Yeah. Well, uh, kiss other th angrily. Other than be on you. They're just. That's all <laughs> you're going to say, other than be honest. Like, just. They're just you're frightening. Not as, as people say you are. <laughs> no! No! <laughs> Taxation is theft. <laughs> Get away from me. Jet fuel doesn't help skill beans. <laughs> honest, just like, on honest bug, just come and like, whisper stuff in your ear. Like, no! George Bush did 9 11. <laughs> no, get off of me! Have you seen that comic? Wait, I knew this, that. Have you seen this comic of the guy and he's lying on the ground and steel beams are covering him and he goes, Johnny, help! You said jet fuel to melt these steel beams off of me. They're not melting! <laughs> And they just look at each other with such intent, they're like... <gasps> <laughs> There's the one where it's like the girl, like, she gets a fairy, and it's like, you have three wishes. And he's like, I want my horsey to talk. And the, she's just like, okay, there you go. And the horse just like, jet fuel doesn't melt steel beams. <laughs> That's funny. So we all agree that George Bush did 9-11, right? Yes, yeah, That's a yes. consensus amongst did, all of us. Absolutely. How did we get to... 9-11 gets This is how these always yeah. happen. This is how they always happen. Like now, now, now always gets back to 9-11. Now the title is going to be Jeff. You'll do it. <laughs> Every podcast we do comes back to 9-11. I don't know why. Conspiracy. <laughs> Let's talk conspiracies. Everyone. We're the key. I'm going to impregnate the Statue of Liberty. <laughs> now, now, you need to, now you need to do the whole triangle thing. Con Illuminati confirmed. Illuminati confirmed. Sorry. Put that away. <laughs> you put that away. They're watching. We're gonna. Sh I really them. wanted like you to do that and just get sniped. <laughs> so, <laughs> <laughs> honest beetle just doesn't know steel beams. <laughs> the honest beetle, you can't bend bullets. <laughs> you, can't, you can't bend bullets. What is it? W wanted was a lie. Just What's imagine, like, if bugs, no. like, if, if animals could talk, would they all just be, like, the douchey conspiracy theory kind of people? Yes. They've, they've seen it all. I think they'd just be terrified that someone's going to kill them, like, at all times. If I were a bug, I think that would be my biggest fear. It's like, oh, look, there's a person. They're probably going to try to kill me for no reason. From our or view, for it's June like, bugs, you're They disgusting. literally live for one month and die. Yeah. Like, they have to live their entire life just going, oh, I'm going to die. What is it going to be? What is it going to be? And also, you know, you know what's crazy? If you kill another human because you think they look disgusting, you're a terrible person, and like you're or racist or bigoted. Uh -huh. If you kill a bug because you think it's disgusting, you're normal. Imagine <laughs> you're how normal. bugs look at it. It's like you're killing me because I'm disgusting. Well, you're bugs racist. Are gross. <laughs> he has a point. Are black people <laughs> gross? Is but that what you're saying? That is not what I'm saying. Always black people to nine eleven of black people. <laughs> We had this discussion too. All of us are white, so I feel like we can't talk about it. I feel like this. our first podcast was when is it okay to make fun of 9 11? That was our first podcast. Yeah. Oh, and rape. Like, that was the two key factors in the first podcast. Go and watch the first podcast. Also, like and subscribe. Oh, I was on there. He was there. He wasn't. I yeah. wasn't. I was there like the third or fourth. You were there for the third one. This is Andrew I've Kidder's known. first time on the podcast. We didn't, He's we didn't a have podcast. sushi. Also, I don't think I've met you. I'm Michael. I'm Andrew. Andrew I'm Kidder. just meeting you tonight. Yeah. Justin, you gotta join it. Let me put my dick on top. <laughs> You're breaking yeah. the table! Really seal the bond! <laughs> Mine was there the whole time. <laughs> you, we just take away our hands and your dick is right there. <laughs> I'm impressed. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> Ta-da! All of a sudden, vape smoke. <laughs> Amazing! <laughs> Please tell me you use that in the bedroom. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not it's, even. It also does strobe lights. <laughs> <laughs> like, if you did that in public, do you think I heard Michael brought a girl home? Oh yeah. <laughs> strobe lights and smoke coming from under the door. <laughs> Ooh, Lazo, they're having a great time. <laughs> you come in and just come dancing. out. This is so annoying. I wish I could turn it off. 
Oh, just something else, like just heavy bass drop. Oh, that must be her. <laughs> like, that's awesome. Also, it's just like a. Oh, it's just like, you go to the next room. Oh, Andrew brought someone. <laughs> New work together. What is it? I what? can't think of the word now. I'm so tired. What? Collaborate. Collaborate. Yeah. Collaborate. Like, oh, they must be collaborating. It's like Michael's room. You go. You go to next door. Oh, Andrew must have brought a girl home. It's like Kenny G. <laughs> This really sucks. If you had one thing that you could, that your penis could do during intercourse with a lovely woman, what would it be? I've never had intercourse. Extend through her mouth. I would have mine spin either like a windmill or like a drill. The, nut, the nutsack is included. So. The nutsack is included. So just lean into the, the, nutsack, the nutsack is the included. Nutsack. The nutsack is always included during intercourse. <laughs> I don't this want is to the best ASMR video I've seen online. <laughs> Mine would. Ooh, I see they're gonna go like split into two and like double duty. Double duty. <laughs> is it two what separate this? penises? What the hell are you doing? Is What's it, wrong with you? Is it two you separate monster. penises or is it one half penis and another half penis? No, it's two separate. Penis. Okay. When you said I want mine to spin either, <laughs> I thought you were gonna like say clockwise or, or counterclockwise. <laughs> like you didn't care. I want like, to spin either, either clockwise, clockwise or, or counterclockwise. Counter -clockwise. I like, how you, like that was a part of it. Like, like, a big. I like how you, like you're not even weirded out by the thing. It's just. Like you want to know which so direction like, it spins? That's no, it would spin. I keep this. It would spin either. Like, I was like is he said clockwise. How many ways can I forget the fact that mine would kill girl? You can do like that. There's the clockwise, counterclockwise, like, barrel roll this way. <laughs> well, the, the thing is, just spinning, detach like a loading so screen. You, you, you ever seen those straws that are bending like that? I want to do that. I wanted to wear glasses with one. So it's so it's it's like one of the it's like one of those. I want to come out with a disguise. No, it's like it's like a kitchen aid. See, this is the stuff we get to talk about. Christina's not here. It's like a kitchen aid. You know, it's like it's like. Like the like the piece is spinning, but also the shaft is spinning too at the same time. Oh, that's cool! Like, oh, like that's like a, like a hand I'm pretty mixer. sure if it went like this way, like you'd kill her. I'm pretty sure she'd be dead. Like, if I, want, you blow, I wanted to she'd be like, dead, or she would not be happy. If want, you're eating out a girl <laughs> and you stop. blow air in her vagina, she will die. Like that causes an infection and it kills her within a day. So I, I'm not speaking from experience. <laughs> just, yes, just, wait, 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 wait. Oh yeah, you're, if you're eating out and you breathe into her vagina. You will kill her. You will. You will one hundred percent kill her. Just like discretion. <laughs> Boom. Oh god. Okay. Discretion. If you do this, it did not come from us. <laughs> we do, we don't Thousands dead across the United States. Although vaping into a vagina is perfectly okay. <laughs> um, also, guys, I have to go test some. Do you guys also? Uh, wait, wait. I wasn't like. Do yeah. you guys ever like? Do you ever? No, no. With, with, with birds. I with birds. Um, I, I heard if you give them laxatives. That they blow up. They do. Yeah. No, yeah. They don't have everywhere. like. I guess they don't well, have they like digestive system. They can't fart. They can't fart. If you feed, if you feed, you feed them fart. rice, if you feed them rice, they do the same thing. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It's rice. So, rice. Urban legend. I don't so, know if it's true or not. There what I a, would want it to do is do the alligator death roll inside our <laughs> Alligators, <laughs> no. Too soon on alligators. <laughs> Too soon on alligators. Can't. Disney. Can we not talk about Disney World? Alligators. I think, what happened? You know what the thing is? No. An alligator. Okay, three, kid. No, 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 I'm gonna tell you three things have happened in Orlando now. I only know about the the big 15 foot one. No, there's an alligator apparently. That was not in Orlando. Okay, though. kid, little kid at Disneyland in the pond, at Disney World, in the pond. Like, oh, I'm playing around in the pond in Disney World having a great time. Alligator <laughs> Drags comes him out of the water, grabs little Timmy Johnson, pulls him into the water. People are like, <laughs> And they did like a well, Why was there like, the not an alligator? Why was there an alligator? Because <laughs> it's connected to a fresh. It's connected it's, to a freshwater pond. I like to imagine the yeah. kid was swallowed whole and they're growing inside the alligator and so they become just a 20 year old <laughs> man and they're just wearing these alligator pajamas awful. and they awful. run out of the water and you just see the mouth like flapping like this and you see an alligator <laughs> like run run he's got the foot he's I would, I don't, but he would still have the like the tendencies of like how like a two year old, so he'd be like he still would, he'd still be like not be able to walk. And stuff. Just, oh, but he's an alligator too. So you know, like, that's actually what it was. It wasn't an actual alligator. It was just another kid who was eaten by an alligator <laughs> coming out and grabbing that kid. And I want to change my ways. <laughs> now do we have Killer Croc? I, th I oh, hope we do so. have Killer Croc. We're gonna go to hell just so you guys know because the two year old just died. <laughs> From being dragged into the water, and we're making jokes about it. Oh my god! But comedy it's equals, not like he's watching comedy this. Comedy is tragedy plus time. It's not like he's I watching this. Comedy is tragedy plus time slash and or distance. Is my my thoughts on it is like if it's emotionally or physically far enough away from you, you don't have to deal with time. You can just deal with it. That's far enough away. 
that like if that happened in like Benghazi or something, <laughs> day immediately of, day of would be like that's the funniest thing I've ever heard in my life. That's why we have so many starving African children because it's far enough away that you're. It's like, not real. It's, it's like not... we're gonna go to hell, but at least we're. But like if it was like fun. happened in Fresno, it's like that's horrifying. Until ten years later. Because it's so close, you got to wait for time. You can't. It's it's distance. I mean, understand. Well, wait, wait, and then also the circumference of what actually happened. Yeah. Because like nine eleven. It's like yeah. It's, <laughs> yeah. Well, it's like it's like tragedy X, which is like what is the tragedy? <laughs> what, is the tra- what level is the tragedy? Y is yeah. the location <laughs> of the tragedy Plus in Reve- distance, which is Y, slash or time, which could also be Y, <laughs> but. Those two things. I think the fact that this happened in Florida and we're emotionally so far away and like and how ridiculous distance wise of, of a weed. It's so ridiculous. I mean, We've had two zoo animals, two animals in the last in the month. wild in the last month. Just do something incredibly like what? Like just amazing. Like like it's not even like sad or happy or like incredible. It's kind of sad. It just though. happened. Like it just happened and well, it one, shouldn't have happened. One was actually him like trying to protect the kid and he got. And he's out. I don't That's think he was, debatable. That's I don't debatable. think he was smart enough to know to protect what him. He was like, here's a shot. Okay, you, you know don't know about the gorilla. Oh yeah, the gorilla. Yeah, the gorilla. Okay. The gorilla, then the crocodile, and then like everything. Well, in Orlando, it was three things in a row. It was. Uh, Pulse. It was Christina Grimmy. She gets shot. Like she just given out. Okay, wait, was that in Orlando? Yeah, yeah. In Orlando. The she, guy has no connection to her, and just walks up to her while she's signing autographs and just shoots her in the face. Shoot, like shoots her, and then her her brother tackles him and he shoots himself. And then, what I want to know is why. Like what? What did like? Did you listen to a song of hers? Is like I hate her forever. I don't like it. Like there must be something wrong with that guy. And then the next day, the Pulse thing happens with fifty wave. with what? fifty people fifty people being shot in a gate. Biggest club. homicide. Forty nine. Like ever recorded in the United States. Uh, recorded, but. That's because we didn't record. Yeah. Well, there's wounded knee and all that kind of stuff. So you're like, oh yeah. Well, what about Columbus? Shut up. <laughs> I'm talking right about. <laughs> well, I think yeah. you're forgetting World War. Ones one. where white people were the what victims. What I don't like is how everybody has to take it apart. It can't just be a tragedy. We no, it's yeah. And it's, and we and we just like you know mourn that part. No, it's like, how did he shoot a hundred rounds in a club? Oh, how did God, he? Yeah. How did he get into this? Place? Jet fuel doesn't <laughs> melt steel beams. And that's the thing is like he was shooting jet fuel. Tra- <laughs> tra- tragedy hits, and, <laughs> and we what? can't we can't just be like, oh, that was pretty, that was sad. We need to like mourn and it'd be okay. No, it's like tra- it's like mourn and then like wait a Thank second, you. this doesn't add up, and then we go into it. Yeah, yeah, and then just ruin it, and then like it's like it's like it doesn't get a chance to be something like. But what it's, it doesn't get a chance to be something real and something that we can grieve over. It has to be something of like, but wait a minute. But wait you a know minute. what annoyed me though? Like, and what I, annoyed you though? What annoyed you? There's like, like that the, like, 50 super people die? conservative people are like the liberal people making it is like a weird thing too. But like, I think it was like Rand Paul or something like that. Like said it's not Rand about Paul? gun control. Rand Paul. That's his name. Ron Paul. Ron. Ron, Ron Paul. Ron. You said Rand Paul like he's <laughs> Rand Paul. Rand Rand Paul. <laughs> like the alligator. No, no, it's, it's, no, no, no. <laughs> No, 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 it is Rand Paul, it is Rand Paul, the, 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 the libertarian. Yeah, Rand Paul, it's pronounced Rand. Yeah. It's Rand, R-A-N-D. Ron, oh. Ron Paul's his uncle or dad or something like that. I, I don't know how they're related um, to him. But, um, <laughs> like, I mean, like, I don't know. But Rand Paul, I have saying, no clue. He was saying, like, it's it's not about gun control, it's about border control. It's like, the dude was an American citizen, like, what the hell? Wasn't what does he, it have to do with border like, control? Training? Build a wall. Wasn't he, like, trying to be a cop or something like that? Some yeah. I don't know. There, and he I, was allegedly to gay too. He was at, no. He had been at the club for three years. That he was a regular. Here's the thing. There's a lot of stuff going around that this happened. Like it was that whole like you're saying the whole thing of like oh well he was allegedly he went there all the time he was gay. Oh well you know you can't shoot that many bullets. Oh well he was going to be a cop. Oh well this is about border control. Oh well it's, it's about a lot of things. It's about grieving. Like it's right. the fact that something horrible happened in the United States, and rather than and us we saying can't just let it something let it horrible happened, like he took it and he had to analyze he had to analyze it from. A perspective that's, for one thing, is kind of a closed-minded perspective, and also not even relevant. Like it's not even relevant. Here's what it sounds like. You know those videos online, usually the Illuminati thing. It, it's those videos online where they make a joke and they're like, "How is this connected to the Illuminati?" Burger King puts lettuce in their hamburgers. Lettuce grows as a head. Heads are the controlling factor of the body. And people do this in real life and aren't being ironic about it. They're yeah, trying they're just, to sink everything. And it's up. called politics. It's a, it's the same thing in real life, but it's like oh, it's called politics and it's real. Where, where this is different. It's, like, it's not different. It's the exact same thing. But isn't, isn't it weird how like if you like you hear some politicians talk on like at least in public, and the things they say, it's like. 
you can't get by saying that as a normal person. Like, that's the stupidest thing I've ever heard. Yeah. But they can say it there. In well, you say, oh, we need to build a wall to keep the immigrants out from Mexico. You are racist. You are a racist monster. <laughs> but yeah. if you say, like, you're like, oh, yeah, because all Mexicans are causing theft and all Mexicans are causing rape and all this. So it's we like, build what, a wall. Well, what about the, like, but if you say it and you're in a suit, you're a politician. <laughs> what about the other other non-Hispanic people who cause robberies and assault? And We're not talking about them right now. <laughs> that's do what, we build that's a wall? That's what it is. It's like, what about the white people who do that? I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know. What about the white, wait, wait, what, what? white, 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 was um gay, gay. <laughs> and he was um not american no he, or, 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 if we convict him of it you know then that's that's gonna ruin his life so we can't and do that, that. That's, that's the other thing infringing they, on they, his they, rights oh he was uh had psychotic tendencies yeah okay you, he had psychotic tendencies oh, I, oh he was an awful asshole so we yeah. can't <laughs> hold him accountable there's so much stuff that i think i like the one where it's the one it's, they talk about i don't know who said it but they talked about um they said it's interesting how they always are like, oh yeah, when someone kills a bunch of people, like he seemed like a nice young man. Yeah, because if he didn't, you would have called the police on him a long time ago. <laughs> like the people who don't seem like a nice young man and seem like they're gonna shoot up a school or something, get be. arrested before it happens. He was such a nice young man. Nice yeah, that's man. the cover. <laughs> like the dude who did, I think, uh, or are you Sandy Hook? No, no, no the, uh, it was in California, but I think it was down south more. He made five videos on it. And posted them to YouTube. Oh, yeah, I just thought of it. Sandy Hook is one of those. He had a maniacal laugh. Make a joke about Sandy Hook. Yeah, that's one. I, I, that's because that was twenty first graders. That's still that's yeah. emotionally close. That's like there's been for time, everybody. but it's still emotionally close. And I know some people are saying like like Obama was faking his tears, but it's like I don't care because that was a good time to pretend to cry. Yeah, like if he didn't cry, people would be like, "Why come he didn't cry? He yeah. should have cried." If so, if he faked your tears, like, oh, he faked his tears. But even yeah, because he wanted to seem human. And if you can't cry, you're like you're not human. You can't. Do, do, do. It's like I if I could, I, like if I lizard crying, people because lizard I because people. I didn't know any of those alligator people. boy. <laughs> if I <laughs> that kid <laughs> alligator boy is now canon for like the universe. <laughs> alligator boy. <laughs> that that He's tail that crocodile tail. Where do you think all that kid shit went? <laughs> crocodile tail. I would live in a crocodile. It's got everything. <laughs> The it crocodile a, eats for it was, you. It was an alligator, though. Well, <laughs> an alligator. the alligator, whatever. You know, What's the difference? The longer snout, longer tail. That's an what I learned in second grade. Al <laughs> you can tell the difference between an alligator and a crocodile because an alligator's jaw eats babies with an A shape. Crocodiles are more of a C shape with its baby eating tendencies. <laughs> wow. That's how the baby wow. fits right on in there. Alligator had some issues. That's why kids growing up to become alligator boy. <laughs> It's because it's a hey. You can't fit a baby in there. Baby in there. Isn't it weird that it's already we're already able to make jokes about an alligator eating? Because it's so killing ridiculous. A two -year -old. It's so ridiculous. It's but ridiculous. we still can't. We still can't make jokes about Sandy Hook. That's twenty. Well, that's a lot more. <laughs> twenty kids. Wait, wait. And but what was... I wanted to point out is that they're picking apart Sandy Hook too. Yeah. Is, is there's already conspiracies against that? That like oh, like people are finding evidence that it was like paid for. That those are all actors. <laughs> there was no reported actual oh, yeah. kids like dead and i was like it, once again we're just doing this like yeah. it's and it's i mean if you look at it there's i looked at there was a when the one in oregon happened there was a like a calendar of all the like school shootings that have happened in the year almost like every other day there's one yeah and all of a sudden one becomes really serious do you guys ever oh sorry I'm so scared of what you're going to say. I want you to know that right now. Well, you know, like... <laughs> That's like, why I stopped with like... Speaking of like, school whole shootings, Aust you guys have heard... The whole thing, like, people are bringing up this argument that about Australia. Like, in 96, they had a mass shooting that was, like, really bad. I don't remember how bad it was. Port Arthur, I think it was what it was. Port, Har Port Harbor, Port Arthur. I cannot remember exactly. Which doesn't help my case, but um, something happened somewhere in the world. It was so a mass shooting, but like, like uh, Jim Jeffries is like a comedian from there, and he's like, so like we're like, I think we're gonna take our guns. And they're like, yeah, that sounds about right. Yeah, okay. And then since then, like they had like thirteen mass shootings in the la in the eighteen years before that. Yeah. And then after that, they had zero mass shootings. And then and like in America, we're like, and he's like in America, it's like maybe we'll just take the big ones. Fuck you, those are my guns. Like. Uh, but we have like. I like the joke. It kills things deader because every like the big thing things. it always comes down is is to say, uh, oh, it, but what about for hunting? Okay, hunting. You don't need a semi-automatic. <laughs> big ass shoots gun. three thousand bullets a second. Has a laser, a grenade, and a tank 
on it. What if I'm being attacked? What if that deer has a bigger gun? It's like, <laughs> hey, that's happened, right? The deer. <laughs> Let me put in my thing. There's, here's my one thing on gun control. Yeah. I, here, the one thing I think a lot of people forget about gun control is if they forget Guns. to read the Second Amendment. And I'm going to say, this is my opinion. This is just my opinion. Because I've read the Second Amendment. I like a lot of people. I, I have a pocket uh, Declaration of Independence. I don't have it on me right now, but I have it with me a lot of times. Bill of Rights. The Bill of, no, it's the entire Declaration of Independence. But um, Second Amendment says, be it, it's like, be it um, necessary to have a well-regulated militia. I'm looking at Second Amendment. Yeah, you get it, look up the actual thing. Be it, right, it's like, be it necessary a well to have a well-regulated militia, the right to bear arms shall not be infringed. So the first part is be it necessary to have a militia. We don't need militias anymore. We have an actual military for that. Back then when we needed the guns, it was like, we need to have a militia because we might get attacked by the British or something. So everyone is in the military. Just yeah, militias anymore. They're looking they're just up gangs. on Cornell's site, so... Urban Dictionary says... <laughs> Urban Dictionary. Second Amendment of the United States Constitu Constitution reads, A well-regulated militia being necessary to the security of a free state. The right of the people to keep and bear arms. So let me free. see, what is that? Give me your phone. <laughs> Okay, first part, a well-regulated militia being necessary to the security of a free state, the right of the people to keep and bear arms shall not be infringed. And the thing is, so being like that it's, it's saying, if we need a militia, if you need to have guns to defend the country, yeah, you can yeah. have, then, yeah. then we can't take so them away. So red dawn but, happens. But yeah, yeah. And, and the thing is, like, people are like, have, like, people are so cool with having these, like, not even necessarily always rapid fire, Super liberal but, podcast. But, like, these <laughs> really, like, unnecessary guns that, like, you know, it's for protection. Like, if you're that good with your gun, all you need is a handgun or a shotgun. That's all you, that's all people really need. But I'm not good with my gun. Get good. Get they, good. Get good. Because <laughs> you don't know why I go to Because they're like, <laughs> four guns don't make you good. You only have two hands. Or a spider. That has six guns <laughs> hopping around on its gun legs. Unless you like a robber comes in, you just pull out all your guns and just like drop them as you're shooting. And you're throwing them. <laughs> yeah. Reaper from Over here, have a gun. Oh, Reaper from Overwatch. There's a character who doesn't reload. They were saying when they developed Overwatch from the character from Reaper, they said we hate people having to pick up ammo or, or reload their guns and stuff. So we just made it so you don't got to do that. And there's literally a character who shoots two rounds of his gun, then just throws them on the ground and pulls out two more guns, mm. shoots them, throws those on the ground, and just keeps on going and it's like that is the that is the epitome of american what americans want with guns right now <laughs> because i need more guns that way if i need to shoot something i can shoot it as many times as i want to shoot it just like still i still think about it though like people are talking about it, it's like you're these are killing machines they're like assault rifles and like someone put it up it's like it's an assault rifle what are you supposed to use it for like it's for for a lot of bad guys in it's your like, house. It's for protection. Like no, it's not a defense rifle. It's an assault rifle. Like it's meant for soldiers who yeah. are attacking people or you know defending. But yeah. still, it's like it's it's an it's, offensive weapon. It's, it's for you to go charging it's, into. It's for you to it's, start it's a wartime. Type, it's literally a guns blazing gun. It's a like they're taking wartime weapons, which I bet some soldiers would even say like, hey, you don't need that gun. You can just have like a normal gun yeah like it's like wartime weapons but i need all the guns and like when you when you break it down and they finally are like okay that fine then you go to your next then they just go to like <laughs> they, they just go to the principle of like well you're infringing upon my rights it's like no we're just trying to be like common sense here like yeah. we're just trying to like think about the fact that it's dangerous yeah i think a big thing also is uh we as americans own a lot of guns so a lot of the people that are actually fighting for it own those guns and we're like the people that like I paid for it. Why would I just give it up like that? Because once, if the, once they outlaw it, it's not going to be worth anything. Yeah. So you just lost on four hundred, five hundred dollars, and then all those people that have all this shit for it, they they literally just lost out and even more. But I know some guy who who's an AR fifteen has so many attachments for it. It's like worth like five thousand, and he's like, yeah, if the if the law passes, that's like nothing. It's well, just let like, me let me just shut really... up. Shut up. Let me just say real quick. Yeah, you just keep on talking. Shh. You shut your face. You shut up right now. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't feel good, does it? I'm, I'm, I'm saying like I'm not saying I'm. I want to be very clear with what I said earlier about the whole thing of like oh the Second Amendment doesn't protect your right to own guns. I think it's fine to have guns. I think guns are great. Guns are awesome. Fun. I've shot guns before. Your fiance like is like a gun. My enthusiast. fiance is like a gun enthusiast, <laughs> and I am so scared of her. <laughs> <laughs> Um, but I'm just saying so the, whole, the whole argument, the whole argument that everyone always pulls up with gun stuff is, well, it's, it's protected by my second amendment. That's not a good argument because it's not. Your second amendment actually goes against you having a gun. So I'm saying 
know what you're saying before you say it. And if you're using the, the defense of, oh, the Second Amendment says that I can have my guns, just understand that you using that evidence, I mean, as a, as a former debater in speech and debate and everything in high school and part of college, is oh, I was a debater too. Saying, a debater. <laughs> <laughs> this is where the magic happens. And by magic, I'm in masturbation and crying. And by magic, <laughs> I mean sperm on the ceiling. <laughs> what? I have a really high it bunk spins. bed. <laughs> <laughs> it spins twice. It lands on the fan and goes <laughs> everywhere. I'm just saying... Know what you're saying, and as someone who's a debater, once you bring that to the table of saying the Second Amendment protects my rights, you are opening up an entire can of worms of mm -hmm. someone saying, oh, if we're bringing the Second Amendment into this, it doesn't protect your rights, it actually says that we can take your guns away at any time. So, Unless be careful. Unless you're starting a militia. Unless you're starting a militia, which I'm pretty sure is also illegal. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. In like that, a whole like, like, separate Like term. the dudes from Oregon? Yeah, like the dudes from Oregon. Or the well, KKK. Like, any of those people that are just like, we're gonna get a bunch of guns and make our own country, pretty sure what they're doing is illegal. Well, and it's like, I'm like I'm not someone who likes guns, necessarily, but I don't, well, I don't hate guns. Like, I've shot a gun before, like, once or twice, you know? But, like, when I want gun control, it's not that I hate that people have guns, it's that you're seeing all this shit happening around. Like, you're seeing Aurora, Newtown, um, Virginia Tech, Columbine. Uh, Alabama State. Alabama State. I just wanted to see if you'd say it. Like, it's nothing UCLA. happened there. Orlando, I just to see if UCLA, you'd say it. Fresno City, like, you, you can just Oregon. name any major city in the United States, and there's Fresno just been a mass shooting there. Huh? Fresno City? And it's yeah, like, Fresno City. When? It, it's tomorrow. There was it, it, tomorrow. <laughs> right now. Oh, whoa. whoa. <laughs> I gotta, I gotta go. go. <laughs> <laughs> Andrew, where are you going? Where are you going? It's done. But... <laughs> It's off. It's but, off. <laughs> you see it like they it's, know. it's not that like when people who argue for gun control, it's not that they're saying I hate that you have a gun. It's that I'm saying we're saying these things happen, and we believe it's for this reason. And it's not that we hate you or your guns. We just want to. We just think this is the way that that less guns means there's a less of a chance. You won't stop if I unless I do this. So, yeah, there's less of a chance. Of you have been talking just as much. Go for it, man. Go for it. Congratulations your chance, because I okay. got something to say, too. I have something, too. Another... You can go before me. Okay, don't another argue. defense is, like, the people that, like, guns don't kill people. People do. But I'm if, going next, because that mind touches on that. Is that the toaster if, thing? No, what? People kill no, guns. I have a toaster <laughs> thing. Because if you <laughs> use that defense, <laughs> I know you're about. <laughs> no, there's no way to tell who's going to be a crazy guy. Yeah. And, and, and you really, can't say, I'm not going to sell you a gun because you look crazy. Yeah. And uh, that's the thing, is everybody's like... You just can't sell it to those people that have, like, okay, all those people were looked totally normal mm -hmm. until they the did It's the whole thing this. of, like, they were a nice young man. Like, that's the yeah. cover. That's you can't, how you, you do it. You can't say, oh, guns don't kill, kill people. People do. That. If they didn't have that gun, they couldn't kill people. <laughs> yeah. And you can't, you can't profile people yeah. these days. So... How are you gonna? How are you gonna not Back sell it? Back in my day, we could profile all we want. Yeah, <laughs> because now it's why. Oh, now yeah. now, you, now I can't get this gun because this. And it's too much. Now now we're just adding rules. To, yeah. We're adding rules to rules that didn't make sense. Yeah. So now it's like just a big old mess. You guys remember when this was a fun podcast and we talked about <laughs> yeah. funny things? Like 9/11. <laughs> like 9/11. <laughs> we'll teach, rape. Teach more gun safety. That's, it'll that's it'll come back to that end. But I think yeah. this is such a big thing right now. I, I, I think it's you can't avoid it. If you if you look at it, all the YouTubers are actually touching on this too. Yeah. The Orlando thing. Here we are. Here we are. I was picking my nose on camera. I completely forgot we're filming. I was like, yeah. I mean, you have a great point. There's this, there's this really weird Call noodle someone. thing in the back. What is that? <laughs> <laughs> you know, look, if I go this far up, I can't move my left arm. <laughs> <laughs> it's like right to it. <laughs> Guys, wait, there wait. It goes. <laughs> go ahead and do your, your toast. Oh, yeah. Uh, well, first, the uh, question is, uh, how are they... So, the Second Amendment, yes, they can take our guns whenever they want and whenever it's necessary. But, like, how are... Practically, how are they going to take the guns because if they're just asking Give me your guns. <laughs> if they're just asking hey turn in your guns criminals that are gonna do the mass shooting aren't just gonna turn it in and so i agree yes we have to follow the second amendment and take away guns when people don't need them but we need a better way of taking them away otherwise Where you just... do have like a record that you have a gun yeah. exactly so, unless 
and, and the people that don't have a record that have a gun. The thing is, no one goes looking for that record yeah. unless it's too late. Exactly. Well, what I'm saying is, if they were to take them away, that would be the process: is look at yeah. who went, who has a gun through the records, and that would just disarm all the people that have like went through the legal legal mm -hmm. way, mm -hmm. and all the people that have like. Oh yeah, my gun has no serial numbers. All the people that have that, there's a lot of them. I lived in LA. I know. <laughs> and those are the people that do the mass shooting, and they don't have to turn in their gun because there's no record of them. Well, I mean, no. Uh, the, there's also the people the, that the, guy, like, got the Orlando shooter got his guns legally. Well, yeah. Well, yeah. So did um, a lot the, of people. So did the Newtown shooter and uh, they asked the shooters that did it legally. So yeah, we could have prevented those. But there's also the ones that went to a back alley, and gave a guy like three hundred dollars, yeah. got an assault rifle, and fully those automatic. how are we gonna stop and, those? And, and yeah. I understand. Stop hitting the argument. table. You're gonna knock the camera over again. This is take you, two because I squashed a bug and knocked the camera over, and we had a. <laughs> you're not. You're not saying do nothing. All right. Because I'm that, not saying we're don't do scripts right I'm now. Say, I'm saying yes. Do the Second Amendment. Take away guns fight, when there's fight, no fight, 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 militia fight, coming. Fight, fight, fight. We're agreeing though. <laughs> but well, because because like some people when they use that. Like they do it. it sounds like they're saying oh, oh. don't <laughs> do anything. Like they're saying don't do anything because it won't be worth it because I won't do anything. But it's like no. doing nothing has Please. not Please stopped do mass shootings. I say do something, but do something better than what we have been doing. And yeah, that's the scary thing is if somebody can ever find something better. You know? <laughs> mm -hmm. Now I think we both have the same toaster thing yeah. in our minds. So let's say it uh, synchronization. I don't know. I don't know the exact way to it say it, the whole thing. It is. Uh, Titties. <laughs> Do you have to make that face? Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Titties. <laughs> it was the it's, whole thing of like, if guns don't... If, if, uh, if guns don't kill people, people kill people, then that means toasters don't toast, 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 toast. <laughs> <laughs> I like. I think the, it's funny. One of the best things. I think one of the best examples. This is the last thing we're talking about that's serious, like that. Okay? <laughs> and then immediately and then, back and then the genocide, spending dicks. Wait, and then alligator boy. <laughs> and then alligator, alligator boy <laughs> is my favorite part of the podcast. <laughs> Just running out of the ocean. Is this going to be the <laughs> caption of the video? <laughs> yeah, alligator boy. Alligator boy surfaces in the in, in Disney World. We got to get a picture of alligator Peter boy for like surfaces the, safe in Disney. You can see him like going on the rise. <laughs> In an alligator suit. Hey, asshole, get your tail out of the way. <laughs> it's my shit tail. It's full of shit. It's full of shit. It's full of, it's full of shit, shit in the motions. Gets hit. It gets hit with the car. We have a code brown on Thunder Mountain. <laughs> oh. <laughs> You're shit. Okay, You're so shit. the last thing I want to say is, um, yeah, I think, fa not family, I think American Dad does the best argument for guns USA. don't kill people. People kill people. And I think you should watch it. I'm, I'm not going to say what happens. Just look it up, American Dad, guns don't kill people. It's really interesting and actually a really good really look close. at uh, gun control and gun safety. In like a, a cartoon by um, Seth, Seth McFarlane. Seth, Seth McFarlane. 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 So now, now we're off the serious stuff? We're not doing serious stuff anymore. I'm upset. This is supposed to be a fun... Did you get the needle farts, Dad? <laughs> Did you get the needle farts again, Dad? <laughs> Ow! <laughs> oh, that one about, came out my penis. <laughs> that one came out. That one came out my penis. <laughs> like, I you doing okay, Dad? Cool. Screw you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the best movie. Well, when you're drunk. You're drunk. And someone pours whiskey. Whoa, into the ice you cream. say that it's a bad thing. It, it was, was a great. bad it thing. It tasted was terrible. That? that was a thousand ways to die. No a million ways to die in the West. <laughs> a thousand ways. The to one die. he fell asleep. It. He the fell asleep one, on the toilet. Yeah. The night, the first night I got to watch this, we were all drinking, and he goes to the restroom and falls asleep for an hour. But we're it was like in three minutes. <laughs> <laughs> we're drunk on the couch, just enjoy them. We're like, hey, yeah. I well, haven't seen Andrew for a while. <laughs> And then oh, I'm like, boy, I'll go Andrew. check on him. <laughs> Doors not even closed all the way. I could have totally walked in on him. But <laughs> I hear nothing. Nothing. So I knock on the door. Hey, you in there, buddy? I, I wasn't sleeping. I didn't accuse you of that. But I'm guessing you won't. <laughs> <laughs> he said, I just kind of dozed off. <laughs> For it was for, not for an. It was not an hour. It was an hour. You're the exaggerating. Movie was almost over. It was You're exaggerating. No, it was an hour. It You're drunk. Hour. It was not an hour. I know. The like, movie, it was not an hour. You were not. Good. There was still a good time. portion of the movie left. Although I well, actually, it's it. the movie is usually longer than an hour, though. <laughs> <laughs> well, I didn't go. I didn't go poop. It was right like your first movie. time seeing the movie, so you weren't like, "Oh, I remember this part." I'll have you know, I was not sleeping. I was masturbating. <laughs> okay, so I, believe you, I believe you. It takes you an hour. I only need like thirty seconds. What? Look, 
He's really into edging. <laughs> I, ju- I just finished. Actually, yeah, I know. We've talked about this. I don't want to talk about this on, on record. I don't, I, don't, I don't want the internet to know about what's happening right now. I just said actually. I didn't, I didn't admit to anything. It's just allegedly into edging. <laughs> what? Oh, Why are we talking about lawns? edging now? Like l- edging lawns, you know? If our fun. podcast ever becomes big, I want an alligator boy t-shirt. I want that on record. Right we now. will make it. Just him running <laughs> in an alligator We should make one now. Alligator boy. We should make one now, but it's really like shittily and drawn on with <laughs> shittily. <laughs> drawn be, on with I want that to be the new podcast name. If the podcast ever gets revamped and we're like, yeah, we're going to make this series. We have big budget, all this crazy stuff. And every time you get like, it still sucks, but another, now it's big budget. <laughs> still below average. And every time you get another thousand subscribers, we do it a little less shittily. <laughs> so eventually it's just a really nice like, hand-drawn. It's like Van Gogh's Starry Night with Alligator Boy running yeah, alligator across. Boy I say we need a big, like, Alligator onesie with the mouth and everything on here. I want Alligator Boy the movie. <laughs> People ask you, what was your inspiration? Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Podcast episode number it's six. It's still too early. <laughs> it's still too It's early. been like 20 years. There's, so is this two-year-old. Oh I, my god, what's wrong with you? What I want on the shirt, though, is while the guy, while, while Alligator's running, his tail's dragging and just a little bit of shit's coming out. <laughs> it's, like sna- like, it's like a it's like a brown this? snail trail of shit. <laughs> He's like NBC executives like, what the fuck is this? It's like, gonna be what the new dick butt meme. <laughs> <laughs> Alligator boy. Or, Alligator boy. I love or, the or, dick butt Or llamas with hats. Because you try to show that with anybody of, uh, like younger than us and they're, they're like, what is this? I don't understand what's happening. Like, you don't understand? It's llamas with hats. Mm, roasted faces. <laughs> roasted faces. Doesn't my, everybody like roasted faces? My, my, my tummy was a gremlin with a with a hankering that only hands would satisfy. Why are they all so why, why, why are they all hand? white baby hands? <laughs> why do you just gotta Whoa! pay? What are Whoa! we stepping in? Would you believe it's the nectar? The uh, guy came in and I stabbed him in the stomach seventeen times. Oh, oh, that that kills kills people. People. oh well, um, I didn't know that. See, like, I don't know if it's actually funny or if we're just like a product of our generation. It's funny. Like it's funny. It's like it's our a gener- product it's of, one our, of our generation's it's, first memes, like our first introduction yeah. into meme culture. It's stupid funny. And it's that, pro- that's what we love. <laughs> it's a product of our generation. Did you guys ever watch so- Homestar Runner? I did. A voice? Homestar, Homestar Runner? Uh-uh. I only Homestar watched, I watched Homestar wanna... Runner yeah, really late. This is? I watched no. it because I listened, to, water. I listened okay. to the Rooster Teeth podcast. And do you, do you listen to the Rooster Teeth podcast? Um, no, it sounds familiar. I listened to the Rooster Teeth podcast and uh, it's they reference it a lot because they always say, don't do that because it's going to mess up the mic. <laughs> it's going to vibrate and the mic's just going to fall over. Oh. But um, <laughs> they reference Homestar Runner a lot as their inspiration for doing what they do. Two guys. Characters. Trogdor was a man. No, he was a dragon man. Do you know where that song came from? from it's Strong from the Bad. same episode where he's like, "We're gonna draw a dragon, make a squiggly S, give him a big beefy man arm." Some I'm like kicking everybody. I'm so, sorry. I, there's such, we're all there's so many weird characters in that in that thing, though. Like, it's, it's one of those early internet things where it was. Uh, I think early internet was best internet, but at the same time I look back and I'm like, there was no continuity to the internet. There was nothing that was like, oh yeah, this is all... Like, you look at memes nowadays and you're like, oh, there's kind of... They're pretty dank. There's a pretty straight, like, (laughs) one type of humor that goes through all memes. Like, you got... Relatable humor. You got Caveman Spongebob. You got Dat Boy. Oh shit, what up? You got, (laughs) uh... You got, um, Pepe. You got... You got I I Hate Minions and whatnot. (laughs) But you get all those um, memes, and they're all like in the same line, same lineage, and you're like, oh, okay, yeah, I can see that they all kind of fit together. But I saw it happen; it's still there. <gasps> oh my god! Oh, pick it up! Fucking guy, pick it up! <laughs> oh, oh, do it yourself. Look out for the microphone. It's Is like, it? look, watch out for the microphone. Don't let this happen. I got it. I got it. I got it. Here, let me oh god! Pick it up. So pick it up. Okay, so it won't get out of your hair. Pick it up. It won't get out of your hair. Pick it up. Oh god! Pick it up. Oh god! Oh, god. Oh. <laughs> Give him my hat. Lord have mercy. Give him my hat. Oh, no. Lord have mercy. Oh, no. Run out again, your boy. Oh, there's two of them. <laughs> Podcast over. Podcast. <laughs> Thank you for watching Below Average Podcast. I'm your host, the Below Average Gamer. Oh, that's a big one. This is it. Oh, fuck. Oh. <laughs>